Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a dip dye at the tips of my hair and I am getting it. Where's the box? Oh my god, I lost the box. Getting it supposedly this dark at the tips. So I know the most traditional dip dyes are um, dark hair going to lighter hair, but obviously I have light hair, so I'm going darker. So this is not a tutorial because this is just me guessing how to do this because although I did go to a course on how to dye hair, I never actually dyed hair except last month when I dyed my again I did a dip dye but it was so so light that barely showed so I don't know if I failed or I did it good. I don't know. This is not a tutorial, this is just me showing what I did to my hair. Um, so yeah, these are the things that I got, I already opened it, whoops. I got gloves, as you may see. You know, I got the developer, which is what develops the dye. This is the dye, and it's in color, actually no. Medium brown, you can see. And I also got a 15 day after coloring conditioner which just restores the color and two other conditioners one for the very first day which is right after you wash it and the 30 day one so yeah i'm going to start dyeing my hair so um i do have two batches this one is the dyeing the developer this one's the dye the developer I don't think you actually see it, but this one's a dye developer and a bit of white conditioner. And this is just so that I can put it exactly where my hair and the dye meet so that I can blend it together. I don't know how much I'm supposed to add of each one, so I'm just going with what I'm thinking. So I'm hoping this will be good. So, you know, uh, let's begin. I'm also wearing a tank top, which I don't know why, but I couldn't find a t-shirt. Like, one that I can ruin. So I'm wearing a tank top. That's... Really smart stuff. Okay, so I have just finished everything. I've just finished cleaning my room. I know this one looks higher than this one. I hope that doesn't like show very much. But I just cleaned everything. Yes, it is a very um permanent looking since I don't know if you can like see that because no hold it I'll try this hand because it has more um, dye on it even up here like over here I have dye and I try taking it off but it just doesn't work but anyways so this is what it looks like as you can see my I, I have now a custom tank top but yeah whatever I have now 20 minutes left to wait. I hope I did not mess up my hair. Because I have already noticed that this is much darker than last time. Okay, so I have just showered and I washed off everything. As you can see, this is my natural color when it's wet. And this is the color that I achieved. Okay, I know I'm wearing black, but basically there's a difference. So I'm just going to dry it and I'm going to see how I blended it and everything. So far, I feel really great about it, and I'm proud and everything. So, let's see how it goes. Okay, so I have just dried it, and for your benefit, I have also put on a white shirt so that you could see the change better, and I'm going to show you what my hair looks like. So, this is basically what it looks like. I am freaking in love with it. It is much darker than what I have originally gone for. But I don't think shows very well so this is the hair it is almost completely dry but i got lazy halfway through and i stopped it so it looks really okay it might look slightly not well blended hold on i think camera looks worse but like i think that's just like the lighting no that's a shadow hold it so I have completely dried my hair and this is basically the finished result. Hold on. 
this is the result in here Hold it. I am very proud of it and very happy and just basically really glad I did it oh my god there's that like die <laughs> although I did realize that oh my god zoom I did realize that over here I probably hit it with like a brush or something and I got dye up here like on its own. <laughs> it looks so weird. But other than that, I feel very happy. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video.